Hey guys, we're Trevor and Danielle. We create videos as a form of memory keeping during our busy lives. Our goal is to use our channel to show others that memory keeping is important and it's something that you can do too. In today's vlog, we do just that by documenting a normal day, but it's a fun upgrade for our apartment. We're buying cabinets for our laundry room. Hi, welcome to McDonald's. What can I get you I need two best. That's it. Okay. Hello, world. Good morning, guys. We already hit up McDonald's this morning, ordered us some breakfast, and we headed out with my mom here. We are at a place called Bailey's Discount Center where you can buy a whole bunch of stuff for cheap. And we're looking at a couple things today. We need to get some bunk beds for my parents, but we also need to see what we can do about getting us some cabinets for in our laundry room. So I'd really like to have like some cabinets to put like our our detergent and like our extra towels and sheets and stuff in the laundry room like above where the washer and dryer is. So we're gonna look and see what kind of cabinetry we can get here. So we've discussed and we we're thinking about getting this one or the taller one, which is over here, much taller. And we're gonna go with the taller ones. So we put our order in. I'm covering, I'm folding it to cover up our address and stuff. And we've got some cabinets for our laundry room now. We're gonna keep all kinds of really fun stuff in there and I'm excited! <laughs> now it's time to pick out knobs. Which ones do you like, Trevor? The knobby ones. Yeah? Mm -hmm. We've got some like more oblong silver knobs. Or these ones, which are more round. With a line with, in them. With a line, yeah. And they've got all these knobs in these buckets here. Do you like those ones that you've got in your hands? Sure. If you like them. Sure, how much are they? 99 cents. 99 cents. We can buy black ones for 99 cents and replace all of your cabinets. <laughs> what do you think about that? <laughs> we have switched over to testing couches. Yeah, I couldn't find any bunk beds. No bunk beds for mom. Maybe I should make, start a business and make my own. Make your own couches? Make my own, like. Recliners? Gaming stuff. Oh, like fancy gaming couches. Yes. With like the nooks and crannies that gamers want. Right, 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 right. Like this or like the normal chair, but have like, because this needs to be a mini fridge. And that, this is obviously okay. where you keep your mini fridge stuff. Yeah, your mini fridge then, in there. And then you got your cup holders that need to be cooled and heated. That needs to have a switch you can heat them on for your coffee in the morning. And then your beverages at night. And then take out this section down here and then pull it out and that's where you keep your snacks. That's where you keep your, your Where do you keep, okay, you keep controllers down oh, there yeah. with your snacks? Yeah, because you, you just pull this whole or section Or you can out. design this to flip up. You could do and that. I, in there I was thinking this might be your surround sound speaker. Okay, yeah. I thought those would be built in here. Oh, that's true, they're in the headrest. <laughs> I can make bank. Okay. I'm sure people will buy them. You work on that. Comment down below if you buy that. I will. <laughs> You just ruined it. Sorry. So we got home quite a while ago. We've been relaxing. It's clearly dark out now. Um, been watching me some Shane Dawson. And we unboxed our new cabinets. We've got two of this. So they're... 40 inches tall, so they're really tall. They come up higher than my hips when they're on the ground. And then there's, they're 30 inches wide, I believe. And we're gonna fit two of them above our washer and dryer. So let me show you where we're gonna do that. My dad's here helping us now. So we are gonna put them in here. This is our laundry room for anybody who hasn't seen it before. Our back door leads right in here. We tiled this floor, so that's all new. And now we're gonna hang it, hang the shelves up there. They'll, it'll cover this ugly spot right here. And then I think I'm gonna get a curtain to cover this built-in, which is like an awkward built-in. I mean, come on, look at this built-in. Like this railing that leads to our basement 
goes into the middle of the built-in. So we just put junk here. I'm just gonna probably find a curtain and cover it and we're gonna have these cabinets here and maybe some sort of rod to like hang clothes when we fold. So we didn't realize this when we bought the cabinets but we've looked at them and they're actually the exact same cabinets. They have like the exact same code information and everything so that's awesome because the people who own this apartment before put these cabinets in and they're the exact same so they're gonna match and I didn't even really plan that so they're gonna look really great all I wanted when I bought these was just something white basic simple that's what I told the cabinet lady something in stock because I didn't really want to order it like I didn't really care that much I was like just give me whatever you have in stock white here's my measurements if it can kind of fit in that area whatever and it turns out they're the exact same cabinets. <laughs> so, I mean, there's not a whole lot of cabinet options around us here. When you live in a small town, it's bound to happen that you and the previous owner purchase cabinets from the same location. <laughs> but we got the exact same ones. The only difference is we will have a little bit different knobs. We didn't get the same knobs. They're both silver. Ours are just more of like an oblong circle, whereas these are a, a perfect circle and it won't matter. <laughs> Here working on the knobs. <laughs> you can put the knob in backwards. <laughs> it's it's for when we lock Grizzle in there, then he can have his own pull knob on the inside. <laughs> and voila, here is our updated laundry room with the gorgeous new cabinets, as well as these little racks over here, which we can hang our clothes on and probably put stuff like up on there as well we just haven't figured out exactly what we want to put up there but that's what they look like it looks so nice it makes this room feel so much more like a room now and I'm, it, I'm I'm just loving it it's all starting to like come together in here it's actually been a few days since the last time I updated you on these cabinets and that's most, mostly just because I didn't ever get around to it it was late the night that then my parents were working on things with us they were here till like 10 o'clock doing other things around the house with us but mostly just putting up these cabinets and so I just want to say a big thank you to my mom and dad I know that they watch these videos from time to time and I just want to say thank you so much because they are always over here helping Trevor and I do handy stuff we aren't the handiest of people we're learning but we're not the best so we just really appreciate whenever they can come over and help us but this is what it looks like I've got a couple things in the cabinet so far so all of our detergent by the way I know this looks crazy we don't normally have this much detergent but when we moved here we bought new detergent and then we've been slowly like unpacking and we're finding all this detergent we had at our old house so we have a whole bunch of detergent right now some towels and we'll put more towels up there I think I think that's the plan and then on this side over here again don't have much in here quite yet but we have the dryer sheets because this side is the dryer oh this is where we have some towels okay we have towels over here 
I don't know, we're still figuring it out. And then we've got some sheets and stuff up there. So it's really nice to have this, these cabinets for things like that. There was a point where we like literally didn't have any place to put towels. So the only place we were like, we, that's why we only have like two in there because we would only have like as many towels as we like could keep in the bathroom because we didn't have any like closet or any place that was available for us to put towels in. So we'll unpack the rest of our towels and we'll be able to finally put them in there and have towels to use. We do laundry pretty regularly but it got to the point where like all we did was we just did laundry because we needed more towels because we only had like three that we were able to like keep in our, our in our bathroom so I'm glad we have these it looks really nice and this really is starting to look like a room my next goal with this room is a lot of just little things I want to get something to hang um, Sky's leash hang a broom things like that on this wall right here then on this side these walls like aren't really wall like this isn't wall I don't I don't know how to describe it except for if you like just came here and saw but um, I think you can tell a little bit better down here like there's the seam here so I don't know what you would call this but it's not a wall it's like they just threw up these like panels hammered them in and called it good and didn't put like actual wall over top I don't know what I'm talking about I I don't do house stuff like this. All I know is that these are really, really nice walls in here. So I haven't decided if I want to try to do something to make them look like nicer walls. If I want to try to like wallpaper over it and like make it look nice that way. And then when I throw like a patterned wallpaper on it, maybe then it would like, I don't know, look a little nice. And I would leave the, the like paneling back here. It's really rustic looking. I think at one point this was probably the outside of the house. And then they added this little area here. See, it kind of makes sense. So I think that we're going to do something with these walls someday. I just don't know when. So that's the next step is to fix up these walls a little bit. And then this room's pretty much good. It needs some cleaning, um, dog food everywhere. But yeah, I'm start I really love it. I'm, I'm happy when I come in through the back door now. I come in and I see this and it just makes me happy. So if you guys like this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to us on YouTube if you haven't already and follow us on Facebook. It'll all be linked in the description. We love showing you guys our life and how things are changing and updating and just keeping all of our memories here on YouTube and Facebook for you guys to watch and for us to watch in future years to come. So thank you guys all so much for being here. We hope you have a great rest of your day and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!